Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Thank you so much for clicking on this video and welcome to season three review of Oni Murders in the Building. Now this season did have 10 episodes. The last episode did air on October the 3rd. We're going to talk about this like pretty quick. My ca camera battery as always is about to die because I did another review another video only merged in the building I do have season one and season two reviews up I'll link those down below if you'd like to hear my thoughts of those so this show is actually one of my favorite shows that are currently like active at the moment streaming on tv whatever um I really 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 love this series I think it's such a fresh little take especially if you're into like true crime you have this unlikely like trio that just really really works you have murders happening in these buildings like every season and it's like who is the killer can we like figure it out sometimes we do some I mean we do always figure it out at the end and of course at the end of each season there's a new murder that's happening so that's who you know it's gonna be going on for the end of season of the following deal now this did get renewed for season four and when i tell y'all i'm not gonna tell y'all what happened but when i saw i said not that character what <laughs> next season's gonna be hard y'all because like it's very very beloved now this season, season three, again, I just said I wasn't going to talk a lot because my battery, I have like one and a half bars, two bars left. Sally, I will say this season is my least favorite of the three. I loved the first two seasons. This one just felt, I don't know, y'all. It just wasn't it. I wasn't jiggy with it. I wasn't waiting each, each, um week to try to see the episode. Paul Rudd, which is who died from season two, two that's who we saw die it's not a spoiler because you see the things you know and then if you saw season two then you know he died there and then we also had the add-on of Meryl Streep you would think it would be so much better because we have these two great people but like it was no it was no and then we have like another big star that kind of has like a little cameo which I thought it was a fun episode also but this season it is more about this musical Oliver's musical Martin Short's character you know he's his shine back to Broadway and this murder that happens I don't know it was very underwhelming I didn't I feel like I don't even know like what to say y'all because it just it it didn't feel like only murders in that belly it was like everybody was kind of you know kind of like I am with this review with this video it's just like all over which is nothing new for me right but it just didn't feel I mean it, it, and I get it because in the show everybody was kind of you know doing their own thing we got Oliver who's trying to direct and like make his comeback then we have Charles who's like in the play but also is having like his own like personal issues with stuff and then we got Mabel and you know stuff with like the apartment and like Mabel things you know I don't know it was very disappointing I get <laughs> it's not much of a review <laughs> the show ended for a while so I feel like we don't really even need to talk you've seen like all the reviews now about it but I still kind of wanted to come on here and give my two cents of how disappointed I was because like I just I love this this season so so much and I really hope that season four kind of comes back to the greatness and if it doesn't then that could be the end of it like let's end on a high note because I would hate for this to be as one of those seasons that continues and continues and then it's just like it was great and then we even did great with season two and then from there it's like blah 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 and then it's gonna be like I hate it and it's gonna be so sad. I think Meryl and Paul were just kind of like a waste honestly for this. The way that obviously they advertise it what I get you know right they gotta advertise the big names for to get viewers but you, you don't even see them as much. I don't know y'all I just I was I love both of them but it just it wasn't it <laughs> for me if you haven't don't forget to give this video a like comment share subscribe let me know like what you guys thought about this season i'm trying to debate okay i'm gonna give this two rankings two things okay as season three on its own i do think it is i honestly don't remember what my damn uh show rankings are because i haven't done one in a hot minute streamable that's what it is i do think it's a streamable show okay that's what it is that's what it was streamable as a whole, season one to season three, it's a very bingeable show. I love, love, love this this series, like I said. But season three on its own is just streamable. Like, I do think it's still worth a watch, but it's just a letdown compared to the other ones. That's it for me today. Thank you so much for watching. Until next time, I'll see you guys at concessions. Bye.